Oh god, is this a racing game? This is kind of outrun for the PC engine. I'm going to crash so many times that, that controller ever hits my hands. With amazing scrolling, you're gonna see the amazing yes. scrolling. Ass? Yes. A to A. Oh, oh you don't have, no, you no, don't no, have two numerals. So an interesting thing about this game is that the more you use and abuse your parts, the more they break down. So you have to have to pre-select what you think you're gonna destroy, so you have spares. I think you should take three tires. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna say four. Two engines. Hmm, sure. Some brakes up in this business. Maybe some more suspensions, extra engine. I have eight extra more engine? parts. <laughs> what are you going to do to that? Just on the fly. <laughs> I think uh, you should take some more tires. Okay, we'll do more tires. Wow, that'd be a dangerous drive. I would take at least one more suspension. Look, Look at this. We're, we're playing driving Oregon through Trail. the Sahara Desert. <laughs> then we get to go to Boko Haram territory. I'm to glad to see that the uh, Eiffel Tower is in Africa. Yes, it's contracted. So this I need it. to... Oh, it's, ma it's manual soon, transmission. Manual. I don't remember how to exactly... How about select? It. So I gotta select. No, oh, there we go. What is the gesture? You go select and then. No. You press down for two, but if you press over. Do you just press down again? Oh, yeah, 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 that's right. <laughs> so look at this awesome scrolling here. I'm getting nauseous, Tony. Can you drive Look how giant. <laughs> was yeah. that a train? Yeah, it was a, no, it was a truck. They do not do a very good job with size and depth. No, they definitely do not. Listen, the thing that frames closer to you and enlarges with each step, that's great depth Whoa. to me. <laughs> and then they like shrink it back down. It's, it's bigger before it gets to you, and then it's smaller when it gets to you. So it's like it's no, 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 a when reverse it's effect. You. When it Oh, and it's, as it's oh. passing, it shrinks down. Yeah, but it's it's it's, it's, it's so like big. Your life. car is in yeah. front of your perspective. Just keep that in mind. Yeah, but like it, it just seems. I get what they're trying it's to do. It's all relative to the car. I get what they're trying to do, but it's so bizarre. Cause look, it's huge, and then it's small, but it's right next to you. Yeah, it's you're, it's right next to Tony, me. You don't need to shrinking. tell us the story easier. of my penis. <laughs> <laughs> but look at it. The love of God, look at it. Oh. I've seen my penis, it gets a little stage fright at the end. Uh, oh. Yes, I, I think that tree was just hollering. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Hit that motorcycle, knock it over. One of the first racing games, I think, to go like day to night, you know, which is cool. Nice little detail. Unfortunately, it's in France. Yes. Where day and night are the same thing. City of Lights. Ooh, you've got, you've got a timer coming down on you here. Oh. You're doing oh. some negative time, Tom. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I think you need to gear shift. Shift up. That makes you think maybe no. No, you are killing your gear. And you're Stop that. Getting your most slower. <laughs> well. Oh. All the way down, dude. You need to be in gear one right there. All right, oh, now. I thought, I thought it was like game overing on me. I thought well, that's why it was so slow. No. Oh my god. It's like it's like gear three has been totally destroyed. <laughs> Maybe we should have brought more gears. <laughs> we should have brought oh, many more gears. Do one more gear. Just oh, that's horrible. I think I think I I think jacked. you just fucking jacked gear three. I only have second gear. Well, ninety's pretty good. Kilometers <laughs> <laughs> yeah. an hour, TJ. That's barely even TJ street speed. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who wants next? I, I need to give this a try. I'm going to crash into something. That title screen is very outrun. Like, very, very outrun. Oh, so we must start in France. Yeah, definitely load up on those gears. <laughs> because it becomes unplayable when your transmission gets shot after racing for five minutes. Maybe we'll do six tires, three gears, Breaks it seems like the first thing quickly. to die was the transmission. Yeah, I'm not ready to... What is this boy? <laughs> I don't know. Dun -na, dun -na, dun -na, dun -na. 
So it does the scaling pretty well, but then when the other cars start showing up, it like big timey, big timey. It should just stay the same once it reaches you until it's out of frame. I think you're supposed to be going this fast, at which point you don't notice it as much. I suppose. It's still bizarre, I think. I also love how the winter, like, turning, the road's perspective doesn't change relative to your car. It just sort of slides. <laughs> yeah. But the tunes, I dig the tunes. Oh, you oh. fucking taxi ho! Have you ever met a taxi <laughs> hoe before? They're the worst kind of hoe. Are you stuck on the... I was stuck on the tree. That's it. So, I'm really upset that when you <laughs> run into these motorcycles, you don't just plow through them. Yeah. They're like, oh, a motorcycle has as much mass as a regular car, and motorcycles don't get clipped and have terrible damage done to their <laughs> bodies every day. So, you know, what really comes to mind when I play this game is OutRun. And I don't know when either of them came out, but just comparing the two, you know, it's very arcade style, outrun y sort of game. What, what do you like more, OutRun or this? It's been a long time since I've played OutRun, but uh, what I really, you know what, I. Oh, whoa. I have I have two words for you. The thing is, that okay. happened to TJ in real life. Ridge. Racer. Ridge Racer. Ridge Racer! What just happened to TJ, uh, as John mentioned, has happened to TJ in real life many times. He is the luckiest unlucky person I've ever met. So he had a Subaru. It was an Outback, if I'm not mistaken. The dealership claimed it was unflippable. He managed to flip it twice. Twice. Two times he flipped twice? this unflippable well, Subaru. Well, in like one, like... So That's it's called story. gymnastics, Tony. The, the way, man has skills. The that way we don't. fate and life would punish most of us would be horrible injury and our cars destroyed. TJ all the way to gear one. The way fate punished TJ was, oh, this was supposed to be unflippable. Enjoy a new car, which he flipped again. Wait, what? <laughs> I only flipped. I only flipped it once. Oh, you don't did? Don't listen okay. to lying. It was TJ. like in one episode where, it, you know. Oh, did, did just one time it flipped twice? Right. I got it. Okay, so you flipped it twice in one instance, it flipped twice. Okay. Right. So anyways, Whoa. he was rewarded with a new car. <laughs> <laughs> that just flipped. TJ, well, gear one. We'll call that a classic, TJ. Your engine is getting pretty beat up there. How can you tell? There's a condition bar up at the top. The tires are green, the, oh, the gear okay. is blue, which I think is pretty good. The engine is yellow, not so good. Got it. The sus is green. It's good. But none of us have managed to make our way out of Paris. Well, this is terrible. Over. Terrible, just because you flat. TJ's a sore loser. Yes. This game came out the year after Outrun. Oh, so it could kind of be considered an Outrun clone-ish. So we just rocked Bomberman 94 and Victory Run. What do we think about it? John, why don't you go first? I loved Bomberman 94. It, it had great graphics. It was a fun party game. Uh, the controls were simple, yet it required a decent amount of skill. Graphics were tight. What did you think? Bomberman was amazing. It was really fun. The graphics were really good. I love that bizarre kangaroo dog cat bunny <laughs> thing that was in it. Cat wolf. Yeah, cat a, wolf. a cat everything. And uh, the racing game is <laughs> that feels so ripped off. <laughs> I bought that because first of all, it's boring. Nothing happens. <laughs> second of all, it, all the trucks like are so amorphous that just like. It says 50 yen on it. So this was 50 cents in Japan. So. Now, when resale you bought it value. Back, back resale the day, sale value. Depreciation, like Tony. Five hundred. The moment you drive that game out of the lot, it loses <laughs> half its value. Clearly, we're very angry at Victory Run here. We have some like very pent up rage. So let's just play another round of Bomberman '94 and get that rage out. What do you think, guys? Yeah. Oh, I agree. Yeah, the yeah, four-way yeah. geometry sure. is too much for me. It was it was it was tight. But I the one thing I will say about Victory Lap is it is no cruise in USA. Indeed. One thing I will say about Victory Lap is that it's not actually a game. <laughs> because Victory Run is the title. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you want to see more hard for games, subscribe to see new episodes every Tuesday.